I think skiing's becoming popular again. Uh, it was always a very popular sport as it, as it grew up and, uh, and now I think uh, people are rediscovering how, how great of an activity it is, how it uh, occupies a lot of time, it's great for the families, it's great for yourself. I think the general idea of skiing hasn't changed at all since it was first invented. The equipment has changed a lot. It's become a lot easier for 99% of the people. Uh, now just about anybody can uh, become a very good skier in a short amount of time because of some of the new fat skis and the carving skis and all the different things like that. Clothing has become lighter, it works better, uh, lifts have gotten better, just everything's gotten better and easier I think is the best thing. Um, snowboarding came around, brought a whole new group of people into the sport. Um, brought a choice you know you can you don't have to just ski to go enjoy winter sport you can you can uh, you can snowboard also uh, yes it's changed a lot but the fundamentals of a day in the mountains really hasn't changed a lot at all there's skiing in California <laughs> no <laughs> That's the, uh, that's the question that I've been asked my whole life, uh, traveling around the world as a skier from California. So where'd you grow up skiing? <laughs> but no, the Sierra Nevadas are a beautiful mountain range. It's fantastic, it's 4,000 meters high, 10, uh, 10 meters annually every year of snow. Long season starts in November, ends in July typically. Fantastic weather. And in fact, uh, lots of developed ski areas, uh, close proximity to uh, some other famous uh, tourist destinations. We have uh, San Francisco, we have Los Angeles, and, and we have ski areas uh, right next to them. And there is, in fact, skiing 25 minutes from downtown LA. Uh, the Lake Tahoe area where I'm from is uh, a, a short drive from San Francisco. Um, a unique area is the east side, you know, the Mammoth Lakes area is uh, truly unique. Um, you get to see the desert, which is something that you don't get to see every, every day. It's a bit exotic. Uh, Europe's just right over there. A lot of people kind of know what's going on there. You come back from a California trip, people are going to ask you questions. Um, it's economically uh, a great choice. Uh, everybody knows America in general is a service-oriented country, so we're pretty helpful. Um, especially for a lot of uh, British skiers. A lot of people are beginners and we have incredible you know, learn to ski programs. And again, service related aspects of it. Um, if you like the beach, you can in fact go to the beach and go skiing in the same day if that's something you gotta do. Our deserts are beautiful. There's just a lot to see. And in fact, yes, we're famous for our wines. We're famous for our, for like I say, our, our, our sea landscapes, but uh, we're also famous for our mountains and uh, you should come check them out for sure. <laughs> so I'm Glenn Plake and there's lots of snow in the hills and I'll ski everybody in California.